And in the morning, I'm making waffles. Whoa! I accidentally hit the button. That's what happens after you show me the waffle. First there's a waffle on the plate, and there's somebody else's cup of coffee because I'm like coffee. Then there's an empty plate. And I ate my waffle. All breakfast foods here are carbs. They have nothing but carbs. I don't have a problem with carbs. I have a problem with all carbs. They have donuts, which are good. They have waffles, which are good. They have toast, which I didn't eat. They have muffins. Do they have muffins? No, they have cereal. Okay, here is... By the way, it's in the morning, because I was too tired last night, and now I just woke up. The name you know. The place to go. The mid-year 2010. There's a big sign on the convention center. That thing is huge. You can see in the bottom left corner, there's a tree. It's a reflection of a tree, but it still tells you about the size of this thing. Innovative. Indispensable. Informative. All minority pharmacists on the signs. No white guys. Damn. This was... What meeting was this? The opening... Not the opening session, because that's this morning. This was like the overview for students. And unfortunately, I had to take the picture after it, so half the people are left. But you can kind of get a sense of how many people are in that room. A lot. Oh, this is lunch. We're already to lunch. Like I said, when I went to meetings, they can be kind of boring. So I'm not taking a bunch of pictures of them. We went to Baja Fresh Express. And I got two fish tacos. The one on the le on the kind of top left is a grilled mahi-mahi taco. And then the one in the middle is a fried mahi-mahi taco. And I got black beans and rice. It was very delicious and incredibly messy. The lines at the food court were huge. And um, we were waiting in line for like 10 or 15 minutes just to get in there. But the guy who was making the food, there were a couple of them. I mean, this guy was on speed, and he was making food faster than you could order it. It was insane. By the time I said what taco I wanted, they already had my food at the, at the uh, register to pick up. This is our group. We had to break into groups for a meeting. There's a thing called PPMI, which is the Pharmacy Practice Model Initiative, where we're coming up with a pharmacy practice model and it, that's why it's an initiative because we're still creating it but our group was answering questions about what kind of services um, a hospital would offer now what kind of services a hospital would offer 10 years from now how we evaluate what services are needed and how you know who should be on that evaluative committee things like that and let's see, what do we have here? This is the interview session where they were talking about interviewing skills. Again, this is student programming. And here I just wanted to take the picture because I came in late, but it was a good picture to get everybody still in the chair. And so you can see that there are a lot of people here. And that's not even the whole room. Um, back past this, there's a couple more rows of chairs and then a ton of people standing against the back wall. This is the Poison Prevention Project from Lake Erie College of Osteopathic Medicine, Bradenton campus. Hoorah. There's a, the Student Society Showcase. All the student societies w made posters about some project that they did during the year. And then when you come to the, uh, the showcase, you share your ideas with everybody else. And literally, like, 50% of the people there were doing poison prevention. But it's an important thing to do. This is just a random picture of a guy in my group. What? I don't even remember what was happening at the time. I just, not even looking, I just held my camera out and took a picture behind me. And I also like the dude in the bottom right, because he's looking at the camera. This is... A girl from Arizona so I took a picture of it she won the student research award and I'm like oh she's from U of A click there you go Big Mac go tell her thank you not thank you go tell her congratulations and this at the very bottom you can see is our guy who won the student leadership award 
And so I had to take a picture. I got a picture of the screen, although it's a little bit blurry because I had to hurry. They kept doing what we call preview slides. Whoever was in, uh, con in control of the PowerPoint presentation kept going an extra slide ahead every so often and then flipping back. And what happened was I had everything perfectly framed on this slide and then I took the picture and while the shutter was going and the LCD screen on the camera went black, when it came back up, the guy had gone forward a slide real quick. And so I took a picture of the wrong slide. So I had to hurry up and do a second one and it wasn't quite as high quality. Girl from our group, you might remember from yesterday, they had a raffle. She won. Another girl from our group and a guy from our group both won. Three people in our group won, and then there was another, like, three people right in front of us who won. We had the luckiest par portion of the, uh, of the whole thing. I just woke up. I'm not thinking straight. I don't think you can tell quite how thick this book is from the picture, but that is my 2,600-page pharmacotherapy textbook. They were giving them away... Uh, in the raffle, and one of our guys won one of them. So, took a picture of it. There she is with the drug information, 2010. And then we went to Bubba Gump Shrimp. This is a picture. This is another picture. Isn't that kind of awesome how the guy on the left wearing the coat? Boom! Not wearing the coat. It was a magic trick. And then, run, Forrest, run! Stop, Forrest, stop! And then that's what I had for dinner. It was crab and shrimp stuffed fresh caught trout. And I don't like fish, but I ate it anyway and it was okay. It smelled fishy though. I don't like the fishy smell. And it wasn't from the fish, it was from the crab and uh, shrimp stuffing. Because when I got down to the, when I ate that off the top, the fish smelled like, you know, nothing because it's fish and it's not supposed to smell. And there is my favorite condiments of all time. Heinz tomato ketchup and Heinz malt vinegar. Very good on french fries. And then across from me, they got what was called shrimp heaven. There's these four cones. And the one of them, like here we see on the left, that's cold cocktail shrimp. The one facing us is coconut shrimp. The one on the right is tempura shrimp. And then the one in the back that we can't see is just fried shrimp. And you can see we were going to put the malt vinegar on those french fries and totally go at it. And then, so this is low. Uh, this is with the flash. This is funny, because now when you're close to something, this is with the flash and everything's nice and bright. This was the low light photo that I took, and it's not quite so good. But I wanted to compare. I'm still comparing and getting to know when is uh, each type of photo appropriate. And then that's it. Back to the waffles, which I'm going to eat again this morning. All right. Bye-bye.